field goal from 50. It's those shoes. It's got to be the shoes, man. It's got to be the shoes. Spice, you should ask Trace McSorley if he would wear those wingtips when he plays, how, how effective <laughs> he would be. Yeah, you know what? I've been having a hard time with my wingtips on, man. You think you'll do any better with these on? Uh, you got, like, that style going on. I, mean, I, I think I, I need to get me a pair of wingtips so I can do it, but you, you're rocking pretty good right now. How you feel right now, man? I feel good. Yeah, excited. It's been a great day out here. All the fans came out. It's been awesome. What's your favorite play to run? Is it an RPO? Is it a go route? What is it? Um, I, th I think our RPO, uh, what, our, what it does for against the defense, really puts them in a bad spot. They can't be right. Uh, so I think that's part of my favorite, get to be able to do it, both be able to get, move the ball passes at the same time and also downfield shots. So who has impressed you the most this spring offensively? Uh, you know, the new freshman coming in, Mike Miranda, he's done a great job. Uh, he came in, kind of got thrown in with the first team offense line due to injuries and kind of guys. Uh, taking back on some reps and he's done a great job. He's fought hard every time He's took almost every rep in practice even with running with the ones and the two So uh, he did a great job and then uh, Juwan Johnson really came on strong too. really You know the hard work he put in all through last year and all through the offseason really starting to pay off from this spring Has there been any wrinkles that coach Moorhead has thrown in there for uh, this season coming up? I mean, it's gonna be a difference between last year and this year for sure yeah, there'll be a little bit of diff difference. Uh, really just trying to get our athletes more in space. Uh, you know, try and you know, get some better numbers on the outside, whether it's getting Saquon on the outside, adding a number uh, out in space, or uh, being able to get a receiver matched up one-on-one. -on -one. I think that's really more of the wrinkles we're doing. Same base stuff that we're doing, just trying to get uh, do the same things we're doing and be able to get an extra guy, extra hat in the run game or get a guy out in space a little bit more. Okay. Now, are you going to work on a new celebration this year are you gonna go with the, the baseball swing or what, what's gonna happen i uh, will we'll stick with that for now but <laughs> me, me and billy will probably talk over the offseason see if we can come up with a little something else maybe bring it out later later in the season uh, we'll figure something we have a big unveil <laughs> <laughs> okay i seen you know you're getting a lot of touch on the ball here lately have they been working with you on that i mean i, I, I noticed like you you always had a little swagger about you but now i see like more confidence in your throws have they been working with you on that touch Oh, they've definitely been uh, working a lot with the touch and kind of the confidence in throwing the ball. And I think a lot of that also comes from being in the second year of the offense. Now we're extremely confident in the offense, extremely confident in the reads. And as a quarterback, I know exactly what I'm reading, you know, the, where, the, where the ball should progress out versus which coverage. So I feel like I'm just more comfortable in the reads in the offense now, and that's contributing to being more confident in my throws. Thank you for your time, sir. Back to you guys up at the booth. Trace, but sir. <laughs>